fine welcome back to my channel thank you for coming back thank you for your support i appreciate much god bless you but if you're new here you are welcome please before you leave this channel make sure you remember to subscribe and when you subscribe click the notification bell so that you'll be the first one to be notified whenever i upload a new video so guys back to our today's video in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you what makes men slash white men play black women play games online or even in real life have you ever asked yourself this question after maybe you have been dating someone and then the relationship ends then you are like hmm but why did this man play games on me why have you ever asked yourself that so in today's video i'm going to be telling you the reasons that makes these men play games on us <laughs> that is the video of today and the intention of this video after you have watched this video to the end it is going to help you not be played again by men because you know the reasons already to why these men are playing games so without wasting much of your time let us start our video right now reason number one to what makes men or white men play games on black women online or even in real life is being too nice not only being nice too nice because there are some ladies who believe that being too nice and give everything that the man asks you makes you a wife material <laughs> but this is very wrong guys it's so wrong because being too nice doesn't make you a wife material but will make you being played because you find a lady is dating a guy and this lady is doing everything that the man asks giving all the services of a wife and the man is not even your fiance yet but you do everything for him <laughs> go visit him and maybe clean the house do the laundry do everything give the goodies <laughs> You think, ah, I'm doing all this, this man is going to marry me. You are doing all nice things to this guy, but this guy is not going to marry you. He is going to play games on you. He is going to take advantage of you. I'm saying this because you are doing all these good things to this man because you do them out of love. But you know what? This man does not think that it is a love act what they think is that it is just a nice act they don't give it that importance as you think so this guy is not going to marry you because you are doing laundry for him because you are cleaning his house or you are giving him the goodies whenever he wants he is not going to marry you have you ever dated a guy and in the end he dumps you and marries another woman whereby this lady doesn't know how to do things he takes a housekeeper to help this lady out but you when you are in a relationship you used to do everything for him to show him that you are a wife material <laughs> so that he can marry you but he goes ahead and marries another lady who doesn't have those qualities of a wife material so you doing two nice things to this guy doesn't mean that he is going to marry you not at all stop being too nice and when i talk about online dating for those ladies who are dating white men online maybe you are chatting with a guy online and then this guy tells you i want to come to africa and visit the country so that i can see for tourism but i would also love to see you will you be with me for the two weeks at my hotel and because you're too nice you want to show this man that you are nice <laughs> you accept then go ahead and meet this guy stay with him the whole vacation give him the goodies two or three times there is a lady who was telling me that he was on vacation in zanzibar with a white guy and, and this white guy will take the goodies four times a day guys <laughs> four times a day he could take the goodies but one day before returning to his country this guy told the lady that it did not work out 
it wasn't that exciting like I thought before so I am sorry and he dumped the girl this girl cried so much she called me in fact guys she was crying about it but the problem is we always give men the chance to play games on us stop being nice my dear ladies i'm saying this out of experience while i was growing up as a teenager you know you don't know anything you're just new to love so you think that being too nice will make a guy like you but it is not enough guys it's not enough what I'm advising you is be nice, yes, but make sure that this guy shows you that he is really serious with you and he treats you as you deserve to be treated, but not being taken advantage of. Stop being too nice to guys. Stop thinking that if you do too nice things to a guy, will make you a wife. It won't, I repeat, it won't. So this is reason number one to why most men or most white men play games on us because we are too nice. We should stop being too nice. If a white man is coming to Africa, let him come. <laughs> Meet him in the open during the day. Talk to this guy the whole time he is there so that you can take time to read his mind what he thinks about your relationship. But if you go ahead and try to make him feel comfortable with you, try to make him feel like you are a wife material, give him the wife's services, then you will not understand what is the real intention of this guy. I think this is enough. Let's go to reason number two. Reason number two to what makes men slash white men play games on black women online or even in real life is being too desperate guys i always say this i'm not blaming anyone who is desperate because i don't know your situation but but when you are desperate my dear ladies you don't think straight you don't think right you end up making very wrong decisions in fact guys when you are desperate it's like you are blind the only thing you want is to see things happening very fast so sometimes maybe a lady is seeing that maybe she's approaching 30 and she has not found anyone to settle down with then this lady starts being very desperate because she's seeing other friends they grew up with maybe they are having kids they are married then they start thinking like i need a man right now i need a man it should happen now so in this kind of a situation when you encounter a player you are finished my dear lady you are finished because this guy will see that you are desperate men always know when a lady is desperate so he will know you are desperate and you know what will happen he will start telling you the words that you want to hear <laughs> if you want to get married and he sees that you are desperate to get married he is going to promise you to marry you he's going to promise you the engagement ring if you want kids this player will promise you having kids with you he will even go to an extent of talking to you about having kids how many kids do you want because you like the idea that's what you want so in the end you will give the goodies maybe if you're a lady who is working and you're financially stable you will end up even giving this guy money because <laughs> most players guys most players they don't have anything to do <laughs> so they end up running from one woman to another <laughs> their life is not settled even so you end up giving this guy money he takes your money he plays games on you he takes the goodies and then when he starts getting tired he will start ghosting you in the end when he is fed up <laughs> he will disappear or if you're chatting with a guy online you are from maybe Africa or wherever part of the world you are the guy knows that you are desperate and I don't know why guys most men online think that black women are desperate that is why they are online they just want to leave their country maybe 
<laughs> or they just want to be with white men being in Europe or in America they will take an advantage of that because they are seeing it because I told you there is a lady who was telling a guy that I can give you sex <laughs> anyhow you want that is being desperate so if you tell a guy something like that online he will see that you are desperate do you know what will happen because they are smart this guy is going to promise you a ticket to come to Europe he's gonna promise you paying for your visa he's gonna tell you that I want to show you the whole world when you come we'll go to Austria we'll go to Germany we'll go to France we'll go to America we will visit the whole world with you because he knows you want to leave your country you like the idea you are so desperate like you really need to leave your country so he will promise you all that but in an exchange of your nude photos which is a very bad thing for a woman i don't advise any lady to show your nude photos to a guy who is not your husband never do that so when he sees you are desperate he'll just ask you nude photos and because you are desperate you will give it to him believing that this guy is gonna invite you to his country he will chat with you two or three months fantasize and do all that but when he is done he will move to the next black woman on online dating apps stop being desperate stop wanting to see things happening first let God decide for you. God's time is the best, guys. It's the best. When, God's deci when God decides, then things are going to happen fast. But if it is not time yet, then you will see things going slowly. Just trust in Him. Keep praying. Things are going to happen. Trust me, guys. If lots of ladies have found love at an older age, and they're in a relationship now a very happy relationship married why not you if people have found love online and they are happily married now why not to you it's gonna happen but you just need to be calm take your time look at those red flags because they are so important guys if you don't do that you are going to be played every time every relationship you'll be played because you don't see the red flags reason number three that makes men or white men play games on black women online or even in real life is being too stubborn because some ladies are so stubborn to see the truth because you like the guy you see this guy is your husband you believe he's going to be your husband no matter what and some ladies can go to an extent of saying that he is God sent. God sent this man for me. He will be for me no matter what. But on the other side, a guy is telling you that I cannot be with you. I don't love you. I wish I loved you the way you love me, but it cannot work. I can't love you. So you find a lady is doing everything possible to be with this guy. <laughs> promising that it will change maybe that situation will change there is a day this guy is going to love her but guys if a guy does not love you now he will never ever love you they say even Ciara <laughs> made a song about it it's so important guys and it's true if a guy cannot love you now he will never ever fall in love with you so there is no need for you to force Things. there is no need for you to be very stubborn believing that this guy there is one day he will love you because where you make a mistake is that you believe that this guy will be your husband no matter what you start forcing things you start being hard on yourself some ladies can reach an extent of trying to give these men gifts trying to send messages call these men all the time but a man has told you he cannot love you and you know what guys a man will never ever <laughs> say no to your nice acts so if you're giving him the things don't think that he is going to say no he won't and if he is a player then that's so good for him <laughs> yes guys a guy will accept and he will keep playing games on you because the whole idea of you being nice to him he likes it so he will keep 
playing games on you like that, but you need to be smart. He told you already he cannot be with you. So he will never be your husband, no matter what you do. Or you find a guy is married. <laughs> this is when things are so worse, guys. They are worse when it reaches at this point, whereby you find a guy is married, then he gets into a relationship with another girl. <laughs> then maybe promises this girl that I am going to leave my wife. Oh, this girl tries to make everything possible so that the guy can leave the wife. People who are married guys, they have that strong bond that, cannot, that I cannot even explain it very well. But there is that very, very strong bond that you cannot break. He is just playing games on you. A guy will never leave his wife for you. Never. It will never happen. <laughs> And that is why I always advise ladies not to date married men. There is a case which happened here in Italy. You know, I always share with you some of these few stories which happened here. So there is a guy who was dating a girl, told this girl that I have a wife, but I am planning to leave her. So they continued dating, but this guy could not allow even <laughs> hold hands in public with this girl and he was he was hiding this other girl from the family and the wife did not know anything about the other girl and the relationship with the husband was really really good that the wife could not know what was going on then after three years this girl was so tired about the whole thing of i will leave my wife i will leave my wife and she planned to go and talk to the wife of the guy. So when the guy discovered, do you know what happened? He took the life of this girl. Yes, guys, he took the life of this girl because he was protecting his marriage. But he was telling her when they were in a relationship that I'm going to leave her. So you can see how these men will never leave their wives for the side chicks. Just forget it, girl. See the truth. Just see the truth, guys. Stop being stubborn and accept it. If a man tells you that I don't love you, you just put it in your mind that he will never ever love you. Don't give him the goodies. Don't keep your hopes high because when he gets married, you might even take your life because <laughs> you believed he was going to marry you. You believed things gonna change. So you'll end up saying he played me. He was just playing games on me. But in real sense, it's you who accepted to be played by being stubborn. When you hear a guy is married, don't even start the relationship. Just tell that guy that I cannot be in a relationship with you cause you are married. If he tells you I am going to leave my wife, tell him that when he leaves the wife and starts living his separate life, alone <laughs> with divorce papers in the hands and the reason why they divorced then guys you can go ahead and do what and date this guy but without that don't be stubborn a man will never leave his wife because of you <laughs> number four to what makes men or white men play games on black women online or even in real life is the whole idea of he is my crush <laughs> guys have you ever had a crush <laughs> so these guys are so lucky these guys that he is my crush they are really happy because they always get women so simple and they are number one in playing games <laughs> So you find out that the guy is so cute. He is your crush. When you see him, oh my God, you get the butterflies in your stomach. Oh, you start sweating. You just like the guy so much that you don't want even to hear what this guy has to say, but you just throw yourself to this guy and in your mind thinking that you can date, you can be a couple. This is where you do a mistake. A guy being a guy being your crush doesn't mean he's gonna like you. You should wait and listen to what this crush of yours 
feels about you guys. <laughs> we always lose our head and jump into bed with these men we call our crush. <laughs> it is a very big mistake, especially for young ladies <laughs> who don't have any experience in a relationship. So she sees a guy and oh my God, he's so cute. He has got everything that I want in a man. You know, you get all these ideas that ah, oh, he's mine, he's gonna be mine. Then you throw yourself to a guy. A guy will never say no to you. If you're giving him the goodies, he will never say no. He will accept. And if he sees that it is so easy to get the goodies from you, he will keep taking the goodies, but afterwards, when he finds the one, when he finds his crush that he is in love with, he's going to leave you. Then you will cry and say a guy played games on you, but you did not listen the other side, what this guy feels about you. You were only blinded by the fact that the guy is your crush. <laughs> Simple as that. Stop these things of cheapening yourselves to men just because they are your crush a guy can be your crush but doesn't mean you go and sleep with him doesn't mean you throw yourself easily like that no you should see how he feels how he shows you that he really want to be with you that's all guys that's all so this is another reason to why men play games on us even online you go online you find a cute guy and you start talking to him the whole thing of being your crush you just like him <laughs> when you sleep you dream about him you think about him all the time and you're like oh my god i want to be with this guy then you keep chatting with him he will take advantage of you he's going to waste your time and in the end he is going to be with the one he loves just use your mind and listen to how this crush of yours feels about you if you do that there is no man that will come away and you think he is your crush then play games on you no <laughs> he will have to clarify that he really feels the same about you he will have to show you that he really want to be with you he will have to show you that yes i want you to be mine <laughs> number five to what makes men or white men play games on black women online or even in real life is believing too much in the words this man tells you because one thing a player is good at is the tongue <laughs> they have that sweetest tongue they will promise you the whole world everything that you have ever imagined to have this player is going to promise you so before you start believing in his words let this man fulfill his promises before you believe him because if you do a mistake and believe this guy give him the wife's service give him the goodies then he will take everything from you <laughs> he is going to waste your time and after that he is going to run without fulfilling even one of the promises he promised you. So make sure that this guy fulfills the promises before you believe him in order not to be played. Even if you're chatting with a guy online and then this guy starts promising you, I want to see you, I want to invite you, let him do it. Let him invite you. Let him go through that whole process with you of the visa and everything. If a guy does that, invites you to his country so that you can see his life, how he lives and everything, <laughs> then you will trust this man. And then you will trust this man cause he is fulfilling what he promised you. At that point, start believing in him cause he is fulfilling but a man who always promises promises but never fulfill never believe in that kind of a man cause that is the reason why men or white men 
play games on us black women i hope this video has been very helpful to you thank you so much for watching this video till now i appreciate much your support your time god bless you i love you so much if you have liked this video please give it a thumbs up share it with your friends family everyone that you think will enjoy this video and learn something watch my other videos too they are so good you've got a lot of things to learn from if you haven't subscribed please what are you waiting for subscribe let this family grow <laughs> until next video you are always here in my heart ciao, ciao.